Take care of your energy. This will make you stand out and attractive because it's something that people can notice from across the room. Welcome to Serena and Stylish where we talk all things level up, self-care and navigating life's interesting journeys like this. Before I dive in, grab a notebook because what I'm about to share isn't your typical beauty advice. This is the kind of information that will have people noticing something different in you, something magnetic, something alluring, a good vibe in your aura, and it all starts here. Embracing the power of slowing down. We live in a time where everyone is always rushing for something. Everybody is usually trying to find something, get something very quickly. And here's the secret. True beauty has a quiet confidence. It has a calm that comes from within. The kind of comfort that it exudes is unmatched. And this is how you're going to practice it in your life. Start by moving slowly. And what do I mean by this? If you used to rush in the morning, try and slow down a little bit. Try and take everything as it comes. Breathe in, relax before doing anything. Once you wake up in the morning and you're watching the sunrise as you're taking your cup of coffee, try and slow down. Close your eyes and feel your presence. Feel your breath, feel your energy. Because that calmness will reflect in your eyes, in your feelings, in your posture. Have you ever met someone and they tell you, I just looked at their eyes and I felt like I trust them? Because there's a certain type of vibe and calmness that someone carries which shows even without speaking a word. And this is a type of aura and vibe that you want to carry and I promise you, people will notice because it's something that you don't have to say a word, you can literally feel it. Have you ever seen someone get in a room and everyone wants to be around them? The type of energy that they carry is usually full of so much calmness and the only way to achieve this is slowing down. Slowing down is going to give you a kind of inner peace that makes people want to be around you because in a world full of noise and so much going on calmness will definitely be noticed and unforgettable number two is build an aura of mystery there's something captivating about a woman who doesn't give everything away choose what to share carefully and let people know you gradually because there's something about someone being an open book. I mean, once you know everything about someone, it's like meeting a celebrity that you used to really like so much on TV and want to know them so much. And then once you meet them and you know everything about them, the mystery dies. The interesting thing about them goes away. And now you're like, okay, this is just a regular person, you know, because now you feel like you deeply know them once they have opened up everything to you. But if they keep it on the law and if they keep some things to themselves, there's that mystery that they still hold. But there's nothing so much special about them apart from their talent and the mystery that they hold. So anytime you're around people and you leave, you'll always leave them wanting more of you. It's like you give them a certain type of air that doesn't really satisfy them because you, you know they're always curious about you. They find you fascinating because you're not an open book. I know some people thrive in being an open book but it depends with your personality as well so if you've been oversharing a little too much to random people please hold some information back to keep the mystery in 2025 and i promise you you will notice the difference of how people approach you of how people carry you and the interest they'll have around you i'll give you another good example let's say you're in a social event and you get in there and you're talking, you're talking to everyone, trying to, you know, have a photo with everyone. You're trying to jump on this group and get to know what they're talking about. You're always trying to put your two cents in other people's conversations. Nobody will have interest in you. Nobody will want to give you any attention. But if you get there and you settle down and you relax and you just speak calmly and you say hi, people will want to know what is mysterious about you that makes you like that people will want to know more about you people will try to find out what is interesting about you that makes you you know just hold back and relax but once you're all over the place nobody will want to do anything with you i mean the interest levels of people in you go totally down because they feel like they already know you but if you hold a certain type of elegance that is quite mysterious People are drawn into you because they find you interesting and they want to know more about you and they find you fascinating. And this way you maintain an air of elegance that draws people in. It's like wearing invisible perfume. Only those who are close enough to you can sense it and they're left wanting more. So maintaining that mystery 
will definitely make you attractive number three let's talk about developing signature habits and this is where we talk about personal branding i've made a video about building your personal brand you can check it out at the end of this video i'll definitely just link it somewhere there but here's the thing when i talk about developing signature habits i literally mean building your personal brand what makes you unforgettable what are the quirks or habits that make you maybe it's the way you smile the way you dress the way you laugh or the way you carry yourself or the way you tilt your head when listening to someone is it the way you smell because these are the little things that are going to make you stand out from the crowd and i feel like the biggest one could be your style you could embrace a different style that not so many people you know go by it try your best not to underdress always it's always better to overdress all the time because when you're underdressed nobody's going to notice you but if you're well dressed well put together and you carry yourself very nicely believe me it's very very attractive number four invest in your energy and movements make sure you always take care of your body like it's the most precious thing you own nourish it with good food that fuels you nourish it with water always exercise or try to get outside breathe in give your body the best treatment and i'll tell you this there's a feeling that you get if you're well fed and you are hydrated there's just some energy of nourishment that moves within you and believe me it just makes you feel so good about yourself it makes you feel so comfortable and healthy so you always want to make sure that you're nourishing your body and moving in the ways that make you feel alive go for that nature walk go for that beach walk you know just enjoy nature take care of yourself because this kind of energy normally shows in your eyes in your skin you know do you know how people say there's a glow that comes with you when you relax when you're stress-free this is the glow that people talk about it's a glow that comes from within it's not something that you're going to see on your skin no maybe you just have oily skin okay but there's a certain type of glow that comes within you once everything is settled once you sleep well once you eat well once you hydrate your body avoid drinking stop smoking relax sleep early you know eat your vegetables hydrate 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 Hydrating is literally one of the best ways to make you glow because water has very good energy. Most of the time when we take water, we're hydrating and cleansing the body. And I feel like the glow is usually more than just being beautiful. It has a certain type of radiance, you know. So if you do that, you're definitely going to become more attractive in 2025. And number five would be cultivate a passion. Passion is very magnetic. Have you ever observed someone talking about something that they really love or talking about a project that they're about to start or maybe, you know, seeing them doing something that they want it to succeed and they love it with all their heart? That's exactly what I mean. Find something that brightens your eyes. It can be as simple as making a good meal, as simple as painting, as simple as arranging flowers, as simple as vlogging anything that fills you with excitement that passion gives you a radiance that no makeup can give you it's beauty that radiates from inside out so work on it number six practice kindness and warmth one of the most powerful ways to make a lasting impression is being kind when you make others feel seen valued and hard believe me you create a beauty that people remember it's so attractive when you meet someone who is kind and warm to people, someone who has empathy. It's so, so attractive. You cannot even explain it. It's something that the world needs right now. So once you do it, once you practice it, you're definitely making the world a better place. So whenever you're around people, offer compliments, say hi, smile, and listen to people whenever they're speaking. People love to be listened, by the way. Listen genuinely, pay attention to their habits, pay attention to them. Pay attention whenever they need help. Do you remember the last time someone showed you kindness? Exactly. Now make people feel that way. And this type of warmth that comes with kindness, it leaves an impact that is not only attractive, but unforgettable. And number seven, this is the best one. Mind your energy. Whenever you get in a room, you could read people's energy even without talking to them. So mind your energy. Protect it and be mindful. Surround yourself with positive people. Anyone or anything that strains you, try your best to get rid of it or the person that 
drains you. You have to do what you have to do for your sake and for your energy because you don't want to go around carrying that bad energy and bad vibes. Have you ever been around someone and then you're like, oops, I don't think I want to be around them? Exactly. That is the energy. They're probably carrying it from someone else. And once you are around this type of negative people for a long time, you end up being like them. You literally start mirroring them. So avoid people who are always negative because something about good energy it is rare so take care of your energy this will make you stand out and attractive because it's something that people can notice from across the room so there you have it ladies becoming strikingly attractive isn't just about looking perfect or being perfect it's how you feel from your own skin it's how you feel when you're not even having any makeup or even when you have makeup it's literally how you feel so take these tips and make them your own and let your beauty shine through. To become part of the Serene and Stylish community, don't forget to subscribe so that you get notified anytime I make an upload of amazing and interesting videos like this. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like and comment on what tip really stood out to you in this video that really resonated with you. And until then, keep it serene and stylish. See you in the next one. Bye.